Okay, so for adding the gravity, let's open up the script again. And right here, where we created a reference to our character controller, right here we will create a public float by the name of gravity. And by default, this will be equals to minus 9.81f because this is the default gravity number. After this, we have this player jumping and velocity header in here. We will say vector 3 let's create a velocity vector 3 and after that we will create a public transform reference to our surface check so for that we will say public transform surface check okay and then after this we will create a bool by the name of on surface then we will create another public float by the name of surface distance this will be equals to 0.4 f and then at the last we will create another reference to our layer mask okay and let's name this as surface mask then right here in the update first of all we will check that if the player is on the surface or not Okay, let this actually change this O to small. Okay, this should be on surface. Okay, so if the on surface is equals to physics dot check sphere. Okay, and in the check uh, sphere, we will pass the surface check position. So we will say dot position and then we will pass the surface distance and then the surface mask okay and then we will say that if the player is on the surface or you can say on the ground then the velocity dot y will be less than zero it means that if the player is on the surface and the velocity dot y is less than zero then what we want to do you want to make the velocity dot y to be minus 2 f okay so if the player is on the surface and the velocity y is less than zero then we will make the velocity simply minus 2 f and after that let's add the gravity so for that we will say velocity dot y will be less equals to the gravity value and we will say time dot delta time so for example if the player is in the air okay then the player fall will be the gravity value dependent which is minus 9.81 f and also we will restrict that by the time okay so according to the time and gravity our player will fall to the ground okay we want the falling to be smoother so that's why we use this and after this we will say character controller dot move okay and we will pass the velocity and let's multiply that by time dot delta time so now the falling of the player will be really smooth okay so now let's just save this get back to unity and if you click on the players you will find all of these things to fill in okay so first of all we need the surface check then we need the surface mask okay for the surface check let's open up the player main game object let's create an empty game object okay and as you can see it is already in the player feed but make sure that your game object is in the feed of the player okay and change this to surface check okay then click on player drag and drop that in there now we need the surface mask so for that what we will do let's just move ahead from there okay and let's open up the environment and inside the environment let's open up the static mesh okay now if we come right here we have this road decoration and then this all roads as you can see 
so on to this road we will add the surface tag okay and also the surface layer as well because on these roads as you can see on this area our player will jump okay and also the gravity things will work on that area too and also we can make the uh, decoration as well but for now let's just focus on the roads so on the roads just simply uh, if you don't have the surface tag then click on add tag okay and then right here you can create a new tag and save it and then after that click on road and just simply add this surface tag okay you can name this ground or whatever you want and then for the layer you can click on add layer and then let me create a layer right here and end by the name of surface or oh, let's just move it down below a little bit more because we will be having more layers in the later videos okay so just add the surface layer right there click on yes change children that is it okay so now let's just close this off let's click on player and let's take our player as player and let's add a layer to our player by the name of player okay and then click on player add this player layer yes change children and guys let me tell you one thing more but for that let's just first of all check our game actually just stop the game and click on the player and let's add this surface mask as well because we forgot that now if we play the game okay and we can't see our surface as you can see and guys if you are using uh, this asset okay this town scene then I think in the culling mask on our main camera make sure that you check this surface layer as well now so that we can see our surface on the main camera okay because it was unchecked so make sure that you check that as well and then play the game and now as you can see we can see the surface okay now let's check out the gravity and as you can see our player is using the gravity as you can see if we move down now as you can see our player is sticking to the surface or ground okay so it means that our gravity is working as you can see so with this done catch guys in the next one